Hello everybody here on YouTube and welcome. My name is Gabby and today we are drafting Legacy Cube. Um, just came out today on Magic Online. It's Usually they, they have Cube come out a little bit before um, the new set is out and so we, we kind of have reached that point. Uh, they do it like to like freshen things up on Magic Online, whatever you want to call it. So uh, Legacy Cube, unlike the Power Cube, doesn't have power. But it is still very, lots of very powerful cards. Um, for that reason, you also try to do less broken things. Like you can't, creatures are more of a thing in Legacy Cube than they are in like the Vintage Cube, for example. Um, so here, pack one, pick one. I kind of want to take Sheldock Isle. Cube Restriction Draft the Birthing Pod deck. Nah, I don't want to. I don't want to kick off the um, uh, stipulation drafts until a little bit later. Future me on YouTube. Hey, what a fun. Uh, take Cornet Queen and Force Garbo. Is LSV training you? I want to say he's training me. I do learn a lot from him. I'm going to take Sheldock Isle, though. I think this card's really good. It might be worse in Legacy Cube, but it's good enough that I still want to take it. Pack on pick one. I don't think the Jitte is that good. I don't even think that's what I really want to go for. Pack on pick one. Um. Yeah, J Jitte is not really like where we want to be at. Not on the first pick. You actually think it's better in the Legacy Cube? Luis, what do you think of Jitte? I'm not actually interested in it. A lot of people wanted me to take it, but I think it's like medium. Yeah, I think I take Snapcaster Mage here. Uh, what is our alternative pick? Nothing really. We would have taken like a fetch land or something, or like a duel. Tammy of the Moon Sage. I actually like control magic. Yeah, see, people love taking cards like Jitte and Cube, Louise. I don't know. I always disagree. Jitte is Chions. Thank you. Oh, I feel so vindicated. Uh, it's Phantom. Yeah, it's always Phantom. Cube is too... Exp like, there are cards in Cube that are too... That are too fancy pants for you. Uh, you it would be so expensive to draft Cube if it weren't... Um, if it weren't Phantom. Yeah, I like, I like Control Magic. We could take Thoughtseize, I do like Thoughtseize, but Thoughtseize puts us into a second color, and I'm not really sure what our second color is going to be at the moment, so let's do some ooh, control magic. Uh, Jay's Architect of Thought is sweet, so is Mindstone. I don't know about all this, like, Thassa, God of the Sea, but she could be sweet. Uh, I don't think it's close to, like, Jace or Mindstone, though. Overgrown Battlement is not insane. I, I do like the blue... Um, the blue-green decks in Legacy Cube. You like Mindstone a lot? Yeah, I'm like very, very strongly between these two. Maybe I'm stupid, but I don't see where volume control is on this new Twitch I just refreshed into. Oh, does it look very different now, Molly? Right now we're obviously a Splinterton deck. That is kind of like the, the, the backdoor plan, always. Uh, Mindstone's also gotta be better now that there's no power. 24 hour stream in honor of last Chicago stream just streamed to us we get sick. <laughs> Bim, you're a maniac. Uh, sponge day green and cube is awesome. I like green and cube a lot. Okay This is enough for me to like try to just take an imperial recruiter and try to draft a splinter twin deck I love imperial recruiter. I think that card is amazing. I think it gets so many really really good targets in um, In the legacy cube Hi PVT or PTV. How are you Connor Ryan? I think you're yeah, I think mine still might be the right pick. We are kind of doing it. Did you figure it out Molly? Is the new layout bad? You know what I'm really happy about? Twitch finally fixed the unsub button where people randomly get unsubbed from things and they also fixed streaks, like if you had unsubbed, and they even paid the streamers if somebody la lapsed the sub from you, which I think is pretty cool. Fantasia, I see ya. Ooh. It's Legacy Cube Superstar Pelucrano's World Leader. I don't think we're into. Ooh, they added uh, Settle the Wreckage. That's kind of interesting. Gotta be careful or cognizant of this when we're playing against white decks and they pass with like Settle Mana. Uh, you can't see anybody in chat? Yeah, that sounds like a problem, Fantasia. It might be Twitch problems right now. I think they made me switch Prime Auto Resub either. I think they made Twitch Prime Auto Resub either or that it's bugged. I think right now they tell you, um, I think I'm going to just take Stroke of Genius, probably. JVP is sweet. Jace Belarin is sweet. 
Uh, Dissipate is also sweet, and all the other cards are garbage. I think I want JVP. I can't chat in full screen mode. Oh, really? They, they remove that? Gabby playing the blue control decks in Cube. Who have I seen before this? I guess I learned from. I guess you, you can see who I learned it from. <laughs> the funny thing is, like, Luis and I, this is the only magic that we will actually play outside of stream is Cube. I want to take JVP. Just online sculptor, better than all. Hey, sensors in the Cube. Look, I like Jace as a Planeswalker card. I think Jace as a character is, like, pretty garbage. Also, blue is extremely open. We could take Sensor here. We, we could take Goblin Dark Dwellers, but I don't even know if this is like what we want to do in this deck. We could take Sensor just because it cycles and it's a nice um, four spike. Kind of I'm leaning into this. We could alternatively take Gilded Lotus, which is also cool. Stunlock, how are you? Welcome. Yeah, I think I might take Sensor. I think Sensor is pretty good here. Spire Bluff Canal is not too shabby. I don't think I want the Flame Slash. Necrotal is okay, but I think he's better in another deck. Necrotal's better in another castle. Hey everyone, I'm getting into modern. I was thinking about a mill deck. Any concerns or thoughts? AWS, I love the mill deck in modern. I have a couple of videos actually on my YouTube pla channel playing that deck and I think it's awesome. It's not the most competitive deck ever. So I hope you are okay with that. And I think it's easier to play it online than it is to play it in paper. Say hello to number two on the bit board. Hey, Apple Say Tunes. Say hello to number two on the bit board, folks. Wait, did Gabby Luis counter stream me? No way. No way. I'm gonna take Seacrum Coast. Mm, a Brit could be good. But a Brit is less good given that there's no not that many artifacts here. So I, I think I'll still take it. The bid board is going to turn us against each other. The bid board is actually kind of cool, though it does mean that the top tier is gone forever. Uh, we were just suggesting he counted. Oh, you were suggesting. I was going to say, I don't think he's streaming tonight because I thought he was busy. Unless he lied to me. Yeah, we might have some creatures that we want to kill anyway, strong. Oh, the taxi and probe is a charm is pretty good. I'll take is a charm. I think it's a charm is much better than a taxi and probe. You can switch it to top of all time cheering. Oh, can you? Yeah, I'm taking blue red, Luis. If, if I wield and there's a charm to like two picks left in the pack, I think. Blow up Skype date to stream cube. <laughs> No, I just, I thought he was recording LR tonight, and then after that, um, because he was streaming that tonight, and then he's coming here, so, I would have been surprised if suddenly he had a impromptu stream, that's all, yeah. Mm. Taking slew bars off the slater board. Thank you, House of Cicada, for the biddies. Yeah, it's a podcast they haven't... Ooh! Jizzo and Sculptor, better than all. We are obviously taking this. There's a Misty in the pack, too, and it's not gonna wheel. It's unfortunate. Johnny! Thank you so much for the bids. Cute, cute, cute. Gabby love Gabby wow. Classic Jizzo and Sculptor is better than all. Our deck is sweet. Why are you so wide listed? We, we asked the, the world out there for a Jace, and this is what we get. Are you guys driving? I look well more rested today, Sponge. Sponge, you know what actually is? It's not that I'm more well rested today. I'm wearing more makeup today. In fact, most of the time when you tell people that they look more well-rested, especially women, it usually means they're just wearing more makeup. <laughs> Big surprise there. Amas! Is it really sweet though? Welcome, Amas. How are you? It is good to see you. Damn! Opposition? Are you guys moving the truck to Denver? Uh, no, we're flying back together. I got movers, Bim. I was not in to do the 15-hour drive. 
I was not with it. I think I'm just gonna take Mana War. No. Sell us conscripts, and if we get there on the Kiki Jiki. <laughs> That's some insightful shit regarding makeup. Yeah. You and Elspie would have played road trip games, though. The problem is that 15 hours is just, like, too much for me to... I think there were different distances at which I would have been down for it, but I think 15 hours definitely, like, passed my threshold of... Okay, we can take rest, though, though. Uh, what else would we take here if it's not rest? I mean, like, the Ponder looks really appetizing. The Sulphur Falls looks not bad. Well, Serpy Boy, it's just important to consider opposition because it's pack two, so it's not too late for us to, like, go into an opposition-style deck. Tolerant and a no, cre no creature deck? Nah, I don't want Tolerant, for sure not. Should I compliment my girlfriend saying she is well make up today? <laughs> it's a Sasquatch. Yeah, that sounds horrible, Tiberius. I think I want to take Ponder, actually. We might wield the Angel. Ponder's just so good in this deck, and the rest of Angel's okay. We also have the Cells Conscripts, so... Like, one of the problems in cube decks is not having enough stuff to do cheaply. Um, Electrolyze is super nice. Remove Soul is interesting. Into the Royal is really interesting. Old Man of the Sea is not close to this, this, and this. Um, kind of want to take Electrolyze, actually. We might wield the Electrolyze, though. It doesn't seem like anyone is blue-red. Luxury says, hi, Gabby, long-time viewer, first-time viewer, first-time stream viewer. Welcome, Luxury. Thank you for joining us here in the live stream. You might be seeing this draft later in the YouTubes. How is your day going today? Luxury! Welcome to the brood also! Welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for joining us and for supporting the stream. I appreciate it. Um, I think I'm gonna take... Into the Royal and try to wheel Electrolyze. It didn't seem like there's anybody who's playing Blue-Red, so I think we can do it. You love kicker cards? I'm gonna take into the world. I, I think the card is good. Being able to kick it is even better. Bogard and Hellkite, huh? We're not really a Bogard and Hellkite deck, I'm pretty sure. I think we are a thing in the ice kind of deck, though. We have so few creatures. We have a Snappy, Imperial Recruiter, and everything else is just like mostly non creature spells. I think so, Molly. I think we're a thing deck. Shell duck come real cool assembled. It would be pretty sweet to to shell duck up a garden hellkite. I will I'm not lying about that. We can even tutor for thing in the ice with Imperial Recruiter. I think we're a thing in the ice deck. We gotta make sure not to take a lot of creatures if we end up going this route. We can get uh Marsh Flats does not turn on anything for us. Wandering Fumeral is interesting. Wow, there's a Grave Titan in the pack and Dragon Lord Ozer Tide too. We are a titty deck. Ooh, you said titty, XX. Mm, giggity. Careful study, discard combo pieces and reanimate with GPG. Just got here. We got ourselves a modern playable four drop. Yeah, we did, T. Tina's. Too strong for modern. Too strong for you. I don't think it's Whirl or Rogue. I think I'm going to just take Funeral. It's, it's good fixing. The fetches weren't amazing fixing. I mean, the Marsh Lots is nice that we pick up a duel and we end up splashing Resto Angel, but I don't know if that's going to happen. Do we like Dungeon Geasts? Does The Witcher 3 have a family-friendly option? I don't think so, Tiberius. I think if you're playing The Witcher, you're kind of like in for The Witcher, you know what I mean? Uh, this has to be... Dungeon Geists or Underground Sea. What's the best archetype in cube? There isn't one, really. There's a lot of archetypes that are very good. There are better archetypes than others, but there, for the most part, there isn't, like, a better archetype. I think I'm going to take Dungeon Geist. I think this card's good. We could take Underground Sea. Maybe Underground Sea is a little bit more flexible if you pick up fetches, so maybe I'll just take that. Uh, this is all, like, pretty garbage. Don't want Harbinger of Tides. Why is this in the cube? How boring. 
Wait, the best archetype is your favorite one? How about the best archetype is you are a Maz? Mm, we are drafting you are right here. Uh, but but really, the, the best archetype is just having fun in cube. There really isn't a way that you can do it wrong. Like, you can draft better and worse decks, but cube is about having fun. What's my favorite format to play? Boost your draft. I'm going to take Mishra's Factory. I don't know. We're not playing any of these cards. Classic Agarabolas get, get betrayed. Get in my deck. Mana War is not bad. We wield the Resto Angel, huh? We haven't seen we haven't seen Pestermite or Deceiver Exarch. We do have the Seacrum Coast to Splash for it too. But we could take Sulphur Falls. Uh, I think I'm gonna take Sulphur Falls. I'm taking Sulphur Falls. Maybe that's not right. Okay, I no longer think we're a thing in the ice deck. Well, Garden Hellkite, hello. Get in there. I don't think so, Slubars. I don't think... I think we our deck is very good. We don't have the twin combo, but these twin combo decks... Like, Twinless Twin is totally an archetype in... in... in, uh, in cube. If Agra Bolas is good in your deck, Bedlam would be way better. Am I wrong here? I don't really like Bedlam Revelor very much. Glanalendra Archmage, huh? This card is good. Wow, Volcanic in this pack too. I'm glad we took up a little bit more fixing because I don't think we can pass Glenn. This card is just busted. It's so good. I think this is Glenn. Forbid is really nice and so is Volcanic. Glenn's a guy? Really? Really? She has a big bust. And she's got long hair. Uh, the last card is a uh, Porcelain Legionnaire. Sorry, I forgot to... I did hover down, I just forgot to mention that I hovered down. I'm gonna take Lanalandra. Oh, Glenn can be a girl's name too. I'm pretty sure it's a gender neutral name. I'm not 100% I'm not sure, but I think it can be. <laughs> She's got a big bust and you cannot lie. Uh, Ancient Tomb is pretty cool, but so is Stevens. Ooh, Hungry Boy made all his way to Legacy Cube. Young PC is... Wow, we have a lot of choices here. Vencer's good, Pyro's good, Stevens is good, Miskalk is good. Yeah, I think I'm gonna... Mm, Chupacabra. I don't know. This is a really, really hard pick. I kind of want to take... Yeah, or Ancient Tomb. Sorry, I did mention that earlier. Ugh, I don't know. I'm gonna take... Mm, Dancer! Ah, sorry, it's so hard. I have no idea what we're supposed to take there. That was a really hard pick. I do, I do really like Dancer. So we're no longer a thing in the ice deck. For sure not. Um, now we're taking Phyrexian Metamorph because we actually have a lot of creatures that we like. Stun like There are bit badges now. Wait, are there bit badges now? There are. There's like a leaderboard. Uh, yeah, this is Metamorph probably. It's Metamorph or Storm Chaser Mage, and I'm pretty sure it's just Metamorph. Thank you, Stun Lock, and welcome, welcome. I think you were here. I saw you earlier. Yes, I did see you earlier. Thank you for the bits, though. I appreciate it. Also, you took number one spot. Nice. Yes, I don't think we are a tomb deck. Like, tomb is much better in a ramp deck. We're not really that kind of deck, I don't think. And Metamorph's also here on three. Domri Rain? Wow, hungry boy. Don't think we're a Rabble Master deck. Elder Deviant is kind of interesting. Elish Norn's pretty cool. Actually, is Karanos good in our deck? Karanos might be sweet. I 
Is this is this new in Legacy Cube? I didn't even realize. I kind of want to take Glorybringer. It's one of these two. Yeah, look at the shill badge, number one. That's pretty sweet, Stunlock. <laughs> Karanos is bonkers. Karanos is always good. I think I'll take Karanos. I've never actually played with him in cube. Let's give him a shot. Oh, it's her boy, the Phoenix. I actually think this card's pretty sweet. I don't think there's that many exile effects in the cube. Alpo Siege is sweet, though. Who's this? Super originality with the 11 months. Welcome back. Thank you so much. Hey, I'm on time for a cube. You are. You are. You're right here at the beginning. Mm. I think I want Alpo Siege, actually. I think all these cards are, like, fine, but I think Alpo Siege is very good. And we don't have that much card draw. Yeah, I'm gonna take Alpo Siege. Uh, Dissolve is nice in this deck. So we did not get their own Splinter Twin combo, which is fine. These decks, a lot of time, they don't even need it. And we're also not Bogarda Hellkiting. Uh, Glorybringer was much more in sync with your deck, but I think Karen will be fun to play with. Uh, I think they're both fine. I don't think there was one that was like way more in sync than the other. Um, just Emrakul's on the opponent with Toxic Delusion hand. Just made them kill themselves. That's awesome. All right, we'll take the solve. Factor Fiction. Wow, going so late. Where's the respect? Take that for sure. We have some fours that we can probably not play. Oh, actually, we like all of our fours. Never mind, we're playing all of them. Uh, look at Outpost Siege and look at Dissolve. Now you see why Outpost Siege is not great in your deck. Kuna, are you are you trying to like Outpost Siege explain me? You're going to bed. Have a good night, Blix. Uh, fire ice is good, I think. I don't think I want ice fall. Hazard or forbid? Forbid is pretty cool. The wooded foothills, what does the wooded foothills get? It does not actually get any of our lands. Yeah, I got I got told, Molly. I got got real good. Thank you, Drum. Dumb, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Wow. Gar 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 luck. I think I'm just taking forbid. <laughs> literally, <laughs> literally one bit. Kuna, Kuna, I think you're trying to be helpful in chat, but I think you're actually just <laughs> being a little patronizing, I'm just telling you. Um, Steam Vents is really good. Don't think I want Augur. I don't think I even care that much for Miss Calc. I can just take Steam Vents, I think. Mm, no, I'll take Miss Calc. Miss Calc is good. All right. Pact of Negation, Storm Chaser Mage. We might board in an hour of devastation more than we'd ever gonna board in Pact, I think. So let's take hour. Uh probably not playing any of these. Just like Elder Deep Fiend. P and Kieran or Ral. Ral's actually pretty good, I think. <laughs> hour kills Kieran knows that it does. That's kind of wild. It's okay. I mean, I, I think we'll probably board this for this if we ever feel like we need to bring in our devastation. There might be some decks where we want to bring in a wrath. I'm so hyped for Q2 Sliver. It's actually kind of medium timing that I'm moving and Cube just came out. Teferi is very sweet. Make our opponents pick Hearthstone. Yeah, let's do it. I'm probably not playing it. Ooh, I think my food's here. Hello. Thank you so much, appreciate it. Okay, bye, thank you. Yes, I got food. All right, I have Bunny Jeff ready to go. Gif. Yes. 
Okay, let's put our lands out for a second. This is 28 cards. We definitely have some cuts to make. I don't like burst lightning. Shadow Wolf! Shadow Wolf, thank you so much for the bits. Thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, this is 27 cards. We have a lot of cards to take out. I don't know how I feel about this abrade. I like the Jace. Oh, the Mana War seems medium. Oh, Man of the Sea sounds medium. Metamorph is on three. Uh, wow, our four, our four drop slot is like very good. Uh, Fire Ice seems like whatever. Thank you, Dumb, for the biddies. Teferi, I don't think we want to play. Okay, we have sufficiently cut enough cards. Now we gotta bring another card back in. There's my food. Alrighty, everybody. Bunny Jeff engaged. Uh, is Storm in the cube? I didn't see any Storm cards, actually. So, I don't know. Oh my gosh, this looks so good. You guys think we should play Teferi? He's hard to cast is my only concern with the theory. What did you get? So, Luis sent me something. And I don't know what's inside of it yet. So I didn't actually choose anything. He just was very nice and sent me something. Luis, if you're here, thank you. This looks awesome. Uh, yeah, we can see we can bring Fire Eyes back in. I can see that for sure. Where is Fire Eyes? Here it is. It's actually more like here. <laughs> okay, baby came small and fluffy. Luis is very thoughtful. He's very sweet. Uh, I mean, look, Teferi is sweet. Should we be playing Teferi? What, and if we want to cut Teferi, what do we... Or, like, if we want to play Teferi, what do we cut? Maybe it's Stroke of Genius. Gabby said she didn't know Dandelion. Did you, have you played The Witcher? Did you know Dandelion Fantasia? Teferi is good, I like Teferi. We have Fire Eyes. Yeah, he was featured in another browser not explorer though, I see. Teferi turns on all your creatures into ambush vipers. Yeah. I could see this, this. And, uh... Oh. Recruiter gets metamorph. Snapcaster, Jay's Friends Prodigy, Glenn, 
Uh, Venser. Yeah. Yeah, Imperial Recruiter gets enough stuff. Teferi plus Deep Fiend plus Hellkite Sideboard, Snake Sideboard Package. Yeah, I like Recruiter. We're playing Recruiter. <laughs> the baby command is done. All right. I like this. Now, Fumarol, Sulphur Falls, Spire Bluff, Shell Dock. And I think that's it. Yeah, I like Recruiter. Recruiter is good in our deck. I think the last question is do we want Augur of Bolas in this deck? What is our artifact count? One, or sorry, let's do sorcery count. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. The sensor's in the main deck. I like the sensor. I think the sensor's good. I don't want to word that out. So we have 10 instants and sorceries. That's pretty good for um, Augur of Bolas. Yeah, it's Stroke of Geniuses in the cube. I picked it up pretty early, Ark. I wasn't even sure if I was going to play it, but I think we're going to play it. I am debating the Augur of Bolas, but as you guys know, this is a Trader of Bullets stream. Every time you play Augur of Bullets, it's never, it's never, I've never drawn a card over that thing. It hasn't happened once. You could play Factory and have enough colored sources. Nah. If it were like Ancient Tomb or something, I think I would, but as it is, I don't think I need it. All right. 10, 3. Definitely too much. Um, 10, 11. So for blue swords, we have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Um, so this is 11, and now 6, 7, 8, 9. 9 red sources, 11 blue sources, right? 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 6, 7, 8, 9. Yeah, that sounds good. How long does it normally take... To get you bits, I wanted to give you some. Oh, you just get them immediately, Robo. They just show up in your account. It's like an Insta thing. That's weird. Give it another second or maybe refresh. Usually that stuff processes like immediately. If you didn't get a confirmation email, it's possible that you didn't buy them. I might actually go out with one mountain and with more my island. And this makes 12 8. I'm gonna save. I won't play auger. I don't think there's anything I wanna cut for auger. All right, let's take her in. Yeah, Jalkin, I ended up going with one more blue source. 12 8 is a pretty good split given our colors. <laughs> hey, Bad Lotus. I turned furry for the day. Uh, this is a little slow, but I think we can keep it. This isn't like the vintage cube. It's not like you don't do anything on turn one and you immediately lose. Oh, Fantasia. It's hard to snipe. Hmm. 
The opponent's playing the least fun card in the whole wide world. I hate this card so much. I think it's awful. Looks like a draw. All right, that was nice. That was quite nice. Can we draw three? Imperial Recruiter. Meh. <laughs> Does it bother anyone that the rabbit chews but never swallows? Don't, don't, don't judge the poor bunny. Interesting. I think this might be a creature removal spell. I think it might be like um, remove soul or something. It could be sensor also. Or like force spike. But I think running out Ral is fine. Like if we bait out on the gate or something, this is totally acceptable. The one we want to keep is Jace. That's so kind of you. It looks like the bits did go through. I appreciate that. Also, you are in the lead currently for bits. I'm happy to see that the thing did process. I was feeling bad. Though I, I assume that Twitch is not going to like take your money and not give you bits. Thank you, Robo. I appreciate that. Oh, where is my bits cup? You're right. Let me find my bits cup. I don't know where it went. Uh, Elspeth Knight errant. Hmm, that's not good. I like it. Yeah, no, it's, it's actually sweet. I did not realize. Like, it's, it's a cool idea. I really like it. Uh, is this a live bunny cam? <laughs> it's not. It's, 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 a, it's a gif of me eating food. Yeah, I think I want to just kill Elspeth because I can zealous steal the soldier. I can... Um, Ral to hit Elspeth for three. Ashlyn, how are you? Don, thank you so much for the bits. I appreciate it. Ashlyn, how are you? You guys, Ashlyn's on my stream team. So yeah, I think we just um, take, <laughs> you saw the bunny and you had to hop in and say hi. Yeah, I'm having dinner, so I just put a little bunny cam. You like doming Elspeth and bouncing Tokyo? Well, the good thing is that um, the the sauce conscripts doesn't have a, real, a point in our deck because we're not playing Splinter Twin, so I'm just gonna take this. And this is Elspeth, and this is at them. And then if they attack my Rao, like, that's not a problem. This is just going to hit me for one. And now they have nothing, and now I have a Sos Conscripts and a Rao. So, I feel like in terms of that, we are just much further ahead. Good, Ash! 
Ashlyn. I move tomorrow. Well, not tomorrow. The day after tomorrow. But I'm getting like the move jitters. You know what I mean? I know, I'm super excited. I'm gonna tap the top, untap myself as conscripts. I think I just drew Dissolve and we're like pretty far ahead on board. So I kinda wanna just pass with Dissolve and into the Royal. Here's a secret. I've learned from playing Karanos and Cube, Karanos sucks. <laughs> huh. Yeah, moving now is imminent. Thank you so much, Ashwin. I'm super excited. But it's a typical thing where it's just, you just want to do it, you know, like, because it's... So close to happening. So I'm just going to pass, and I'm going to pass with Dissolve and into the Royal. Hey, so you're a penguin. I'm having dinner, so Bunny is replacing me for now. Hmm. Yeah, I also am tired of doing long distance robots, so that is going to be really exciting. Or that is one of the things I'm most excited about. Yeah, so you. Yeah. It's just a, a looping gif. Hmm. Well, I don't know that I get to resolve the Jace there, Jelkin, so you're being ratty. Being ratty. I think I'm going to dissolve this. I'll into the royal the next thing if I need to. Uh, I don't think I want to land. That's not too shabby. Uh, Ashok is very good Fantasia. Ashok is just one of the better Q Planeswalkers, like, full stop. Oh, actually, I didn't want to play a land. Shaketa, we are twinless twin. What is my opponent's draw? Top, sure. Oh, hello. Well, that sucked. This was intense. So we have to keep into the royal. God damn, this, th th them and treating the angels is actually like really fucking us up. <laughs> I guess I just 
Ral and untap my cells conscripts and I into the royal stone. I hope that they attack poorly, maybe is my hope. Okay, so tap this, untap. Actually, untapping cells conscripts doesn't even matter. No, I'm not gonna dome them. I'm gonna hope they play bad and they don't attack properly into our stuff. Um, okay, they attack properly into our stuff. That is very unfortunate. So they sent one and one, one. Yeah, none of them are coming at me. That was a good attack by our opponent. Chad needs to, yeah, Chad needs to read what the cards do. Chad's adjusting next level plays. Molly, Chad is very bad at cubing. Are you, is your body ready for this? <laughs> <laughs> so I think we're gonna um, Vencer to bounce an angel and into the royal to bounce an angel. But we are in rough shape. All right, we're gonna vent her into the royal. Actually, I might wanna even do it. I should have done that under turn. I was busy arguing about chat. Hmm. If they have a response, they still do it and they still kill both walkers. Except then four damage goes to the face, so that actually sounds way worse. Yeah, no, I don't I don't think we should have done it before combat. I think whoever's suggesting that is not I don't think it's a good line. Um We vents are on their turn. Then Metamorph and Conscripts to take an Angel and we help. Yeah, I mean, the plan... I actually am gonna just pass. I'm gonna let them... I'm gonna let them on top. That's fine. I don't know common nook, I just disagree. Yeah, we just end up taking more damage to the face. So this is Karanos? Yeah. Um, yeah, so I think we might be copying Dungeon Guys to tap the Angel. I think that's what we're, so I think that's what we're doing for sure. 
But alternatively, we could play Kyranos this turn and Ponder. I think we have to stop these two from attacking. So we'll copy... We're going to Ponder first, but we're going to cast Geists this turn. Or we're going to cast Phyrexian Metamorph copying Geists. Yeah, we, we have to deal with the Angel. I actually don't like any of these cards. I think we need more, like, more aggressive stuff given what's going on in our hands. Like, counter spells aren't really going to save us. So, I'm going to say any order, and then I'm going to shuffle. Uh, mine sounds fine. Yeah, Teferi does counter miracles. Um, in case their last card, what are the odds that their last card is Sensor? I mean, they could draw it from Sensor's Dividing Top anyway. So I think I'm going to take some damage, and I'm going to pay uh, one extra here. Ugh. Obviously, it doesn't work as always. No, 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 no. There you go. And this just plays also around four spike. Or mana type. Are we resolving? Sick. And before four spike and sensor, they only have one card. <laughs> that would have been pretty tilting. Uh, we can't attack here. They do now have attacks with a celestial call native. That's what they want to do. This is legacy twinless twin. <laughs> Sorry, Fuzzy. I'm still eating. I did shuffle. <laughs> I did shuffle, Narbly. beats <laughs> when you play magic online there are certain risks you take the show i am by the way for what it's worth i am convinced that the shuffle bug is a real thing like i'm a hundred percent convinced zach zach thank you so much for the 19 months and welcome back how have you been 19 merry party merry party to fam oh my freaking god did you guys see what just happened? Oh my, my opponent has a really annoying deck. <sighs> Welcome back though, Zach. I hope you're doing fantastic. I do appreciate the 19 months. Yes, we actually got owned about the fact that Karinos was a creature because it got shuffled along there, too. Okay, we need to draw something spicy. I mean... Gosh, none of these are great. We're getting there on this. I 
think it's control magic and then we just hope to steal something of theirs, but my god, we are just getting- <laughs> Welcome to Brown Town Population Us. This sucks. What are we supposed to do? Are we supposed to just try to race? Like, crack the Mind Stone, animate the Fumeral, and Bash? They can't attack right now. It's in control magic if I get killed me. <laughs> oh, hello. What's in our deck still? Let's see what we have in the yard. Uh, Sensor, Dissolve, Jace, Ral, Ponder, Mindstone. JVP is not really good here. Oh, Glenelendra? Yeah, Glenelendra's gotta be it. We can't even play her this turn, though. Hold on. Are we supposed to... Hmm. Hmm. Give me one second, chat. But if it falls off, it's not a creature. Glenelendra. I think we get to we get get Glenelendra and at least she can block twice, but I'm I still feel bad about all this. We can also take a look at our options. <clears throat> uh, let's see. Metamorph. Snappy. This is non-land permanent. Wow, I didn't know we've been going up, but you look great on screen right now. <laughs> Thank you, Sponsy. Yeah, well, well, I don't even know if Snap is right. I think it's Glenelendra. Snappy is tempting, but what do we get? Ponder? Phyrexian into Vencer? I think it's Glenn, you guys. Snap Ponder. Snap Ponder is something we can do this turn, though. Actually, okay. Vencer to bounds the colonnades don't doesn't do that much uh, all right okay i'm gonna snapcaster and i think i want to do that now to cast ponder yeah i don't want to go to eight because then that's two hits from colonnade we want to have as many we want to have three hits from colonnade before we die god are you serious any order please shuffle shuffle <laughs> so Oh boy. I think now we just might be dead. So they, um, huh. He made it so that Wandering Fumeral can't attack. And they also have a Colonnade activation up so I can't even attack Gideon of the Trials. Hmm. 
This is Legacy Cube, yeah. It came back today. Hey, Darsky, how are you? Welcome. Okay, I can take off the bunny for now because I'm not currently having dessert yet. But the bunny's coming back in a second. Ba bam. We can't take Gideon, can we? You control enchanted creature. This is not a creature. How do you guys want to steal? How do you guys want to steal Gideon? Oh, if he attacks with it? Oh, yeah, I guess we could. I guess we just play a Sulphur Falls and pass. It's gonna, f yeah, I, I don't like this play. It's just not gonna, we don't get to keep it, so I don't know. Hmm. Not yet lucky, I'm still here. I move in two days. Yes, Louise, it did, thank you, you're the best. It is really, really good. I'm actually waiting right now to have dessert. I'm also like losing badly now. Oh, my darker half, you must be new here. We could just kill Gideon right now, I guess. That's an, that's an option. Uh, I think I'm not gonna attack, and when they... Attack with Gideon, I'm gonna steal the, um... At some point, I think they're gonna attack with Colonnade and Gideon. Can't take Colonnade when they try to attack and kill Gids. Long time lurker, but I thought it was worth bringing to your attention. It's just funny, my darker half, because timing out is like a trademark in the stream. So people say it like I haven't noticed the clock. It's just funny. <laughs> All right, well, there's our uh, control magic target. Hey, K Soup. I'm excited for Cube 2. Hello, what is this? Sure. Yes, this is a timing out honored tradition. Long honored tradition in this stream. Now and forever. Hey, JM, how are you? Welcome. It is good to see you. We are in troubles. Sure. Mine. So I think it's Tallrand here. Um, because yeah, boom. We don't get to kill Gideon this turn. We do get to attack with these two. I guess they're just going to trade off the tall ran, which I don't want to do. Um, I'll just block with Celestial Colonnade next turn if I have to. So I'm going to... Yeah, we're, we're back in this game now. I think I'm just going to play Island and Pass. The only problem is if they draw... <laughs> Stroke yourself real good. <laughs> The only problem is if they have a counter spell, we I, I, should I just do it now? I think I should. All right, I'm gonna do it for five. Six. 
seven. I'm gonna do it for all. I don't care about your rules. Um, I think I'm gonna start attacking them. I guess I should attack Gideon, actually. I don't know. I'm greedy. I just went for... Can't stroke for 20 on opponent. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to, like, I'm gonna have to work through this Gideon to win this game no matter what, I think. I wish there were a way to kill that Gideon. Like, if I could steal with conscripts, that'd be pretty sweet. Hi, Shino. How are you? They plused my fumarole still. No way, man. Whatever it is they're doing. No way. No freaking way. Uh, I'm just going to kill Gideon. Hold on. So two gids, 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 opponent, bam. Who was that? JM, thank you so much for the first time sub and welcome. Thank you, thank you for supporting the stream. I do appreciate that. All right, we are in very good shape now. Yeah, I don't know. If they saw us draw seven, I don't know why they didn't cast Stroke in response or something. I Did I have lethal? I'm playing fast. I'm trying to win. Like, I'm trying to finish this game so we can win next turn. Uh, I can just... This is... Tab target permanent. All right. We got it. Uh, yeah, we should have enough. Cut that out of your system. Thank you, JM. I appreciate it. Ice. Ice, baby. All right, we have four minutes. Yeah, we're probably timing out. Hmm. We might not more stream sweet. Who was that? Trey, thank you so much for the first time sub. Welcome also. I know that Conscript can take a land there, but it doesn't really matter. Hmm. Luis, no. No, no, I'm 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 most almost certainly timing out. Tell me out what is this variety Tuesday? <laughs> I'm pretty sure we're gonna time out. I, I'm always the one that's telling chat to relax and just to take a deep breath because they think we're gonna time out, but we're probably not gonna time out. No, this time I can just tell you we're almost certainly timing out. It was game one, yeah. We took a long time in game one. This is Legacy Cube. Thank you, Trey. I appreciate it nonetheless. Enjoy the emotes. Mm. Fussy. Ambush Viper is my favorite card, basically. Yeah, we can't stroke a genius, I don't think. 
I think we want like Elder Deep Fiend. And I might want a Loxodon Warhammer. Karanos is definitely like super slow kill. Mm. I mean, Jason Mind Sculptor is still good. Ral feels like. I guess Ral bolts them, but it feels pretty slow. I don't know. All right, let's try to do this, shall we? And I'll time out. We're going to time out, though. Hellkite's so expensive, though, Luis. I don't know. Maybe I should have brought it in. I thought Elder Deep Friend was going to be like the, the Garden Hellkite replacement. Oh, man. I'm going to keep this, but we don't have blue. We have a couple draw slips to find it, though. And we have Warhammer, my sideboard technology. We also have Metamorph, so they play something we can copy it. All right, we need to draw blue source like next turn. Okay, we got ourselves a Silver Blade Paladin. <laughs> oh boy. I might scoop this game because it doesn't look like a game we're going to win. Right? Like, it seems so unlikely. I'm going to see one more card. I'm gonna scoop. Okay. We're gonna scoop and go to game three. <laughs> Let's bring Bogard and Hellkite in. That was game two, Zach. Yes. Game one took forever. To be fair, I was like playing very slowly and I had dinner. Um, but yeah, now we're, now we're timing up for sure. That was one g game one earlier. <laughs> Lol. I don't think that thing in the edge is very good in our deck. Like, I don't think it's gonna get us a quick win. I'll bring a braid and take a warhammer. Yeah, Burst Lightning's good. I'll take, I'll keep a Garden, take out Elder, bring Burst Lightning, take out... Hmm. Mana Ward does seem fine. Actually, Bogard on Hellkite. I'm not, there's no way I'm getting to turn 8. Alright. We gotta draw red swords by turn three, but I think this hand's fine. Like, I think we keep this hand even if, like, regardless of how it would be. I don't think you can mulligan this hand. We have a lot of red in the deck, too, so... Ancestral vision. Unfortunate. Come on, red source. Yeah, I'm gonna try to Teferi that. I will. Duty! Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thank you so much for joining the stream. I hope I get to censor something here. I have two counters on this. They pitched the planes. Cast the three. Okay, I'm cycling this then.
What was the deck you were running yesterday in standard? Someone knows. Ah, uh, yeah, it's called red green. Mm. Well, they are fixing me. It's called red green monsters. So, quick question, chat. Um, do I have to? Do I do it in response to the ancestral vision? Or should we just play it and put it in play before? You need it to be in play before they cast it. Okay, yeah, that's the question I had. If they don't untap, you do it in response to the trigger and that's fine. See, but the problem is now, like, they're going to put the trigger on the stack. They haven't... Oh, you do it. Oh, God. I didn't... I turned off auto yields, so we'll... Oh, God. Frickin' taste. I'm gonna burst the looter, yeah. I haven't seen four spike, no. I'll burst lightning that guy. Actually... I'm just gonna is it charm that guy I think or like bounce it with Jason Mind Sculptor. The fairy worked, yeah, we got there. Hold on. Oh, okay, they can kill my Jace. What are we getting with Imperial Recruiter? Probably... I guess I should have maybe... Mm. Maybe I should have just ticked up Jace so that Colony couldn't kill it. But I kind of also thought that we should just try to... <laughs> yeah, it's next level strats, Louise. Uh... I think I want Glenn. Uh, maybe Venser? Venser. Alright, Venser it is. I should have plus. Honestly, I just wanted... Usually it's better to brainstorm, but I didn't honestly see that they had a Celestial Colonnade, so... Oh, that's true, our creatures do have flash. I was thinking for, like, more for this kind of thing. To, like, counter a spell. Go! Okay, I think we got this. I think we got this. <laughs> We had two, four minutes to play game two and game three. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm gonna... That's fine. Giga Surge, thank you so much! I will not F6 this turn, don't worry. I have to Mana War at the end of the turn. Thank you so much, Giga Surge. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, I appreciate that. Oh, bam, <laughs> we did it. Three minutes, it took us a whole three minutes to win that match, okay? And you thought I couldn't do it. I just wanted, I just wanted Chet to have to feel it. <laughs> Earn that win. <laughs> hey Spanky, also thank you so much again Giga Search for the six months. You get a new hat today. Sorry, I couldn't see how many months it was before. I was in the middle of timing out. God, my little gooby heart is beating. <laughs> mm. 
<laughs> that was awesome. Where's your faith, Alicia? My child doesn't believe in me. It's pretty brutal. Hey, Odin, welcome. <laughs> Do I miss Cube? Oh yeah, Molly, I live for Cube. We had some like real chat lethal lines. Not lines, I think during the draft there was some like pretty chat lethal thing going on. There you go. Sliver believed. To be fair, I didn't believe in you. <laughs> that sounds fine. Why can't we ever have two colors? You got Secret Hitler today? Yes! Happy birthday! I know it's belated. Luis, did you pick up all the other packages that went to your place? How many duels do I have? Hmm. They're the ones from the other day, Louise. You never told me we got them. This isn't from today. It was from, like, yesterday. To be honest, we started believing once we scooped game two. I think scooping game two was totally right. I'm an optimist who cares of a glass half full over half empty. There's water in it. You can drink. Yes! Oh, my God. Tomorrow's my last stream from here. Mm, probably gonna bounce that. I don't particularly want to take a ton of damage here. Maybe we get to censor something. Maybe we get to... Oh, I guess if we iced it, we could have... That's fine. Now they're gonna play... Yeah. We did def want to ice up keep. Yeah, I should have probably just done it. We did get to counter that though. That's not too bad. Land? That's nice. All right, we'll just take some damage from Jackal Pup and then we'll factor fiction. Sure. We can't cast that taste. Oh! <laughs> they didn't play a land because they were hoping to hit a land, but then they couldn't play their card because... Oh, it's until end of turn you can cast it. It's not like Chandra. Nine months. Three squared. Ten minus one. Gabby, hi, Gabby. Thank you Gabby, so Gabby, much, Gabby, Sliver. Well. Thank you also for believing. Sliver believed. Um, Uh, yeah, that's fine. Nah, I'm not gonna ice. I want a fact for fiction. Wait, oh, sorry, it's Sliver and Onions. I'm sorry, I read the wrong username. Sliver and Onions, thank you so much for the nine-month resub. Totally wrong. They... I think we take Mountain and Ponder. Like, Conscripts is fine, but it's not even that good. Uh, and we drew Recruiter. Uh, so let's ice the Iron Shaman and the Abbot. And... Oh. We can Metamorph the Abbot, actually. I'm going to ignore how many people are watching me misplay right now. Nah, you're good. I didn't mean ice, sorry, fire, fire. I meant, that's why I was talking about splitting it. 
But I think I want to metamorph the Abbot of Carol Keep before I kill stuff. <laughs> Great job saving fire and ice. Um, uh, fire costs two, correct? One, two, three. Oh my gosh, casting fracks and metamorph always. That's true, I'm probably not... Yeah, you're probably right. All right, let me ponder first then. Uh, these are all fine, actually. Rowl is nice, too. I think we go... Is a charm. Rowl. Fencer. Uh, do not shuffle library and I draw Vencer. And we're gonna fire. I'm just gonna do it now while they're tapped out. We'll take one hit from the Jackal Pup, but that don't even matter. <laughs> That's LSV greed rubbing in on you. Greed is good, chat. Like Seth Manfield with the Liliana ultimate last night, says JP. <laughs> All right, we'll take a hit. I, I am happy that they didn't hit like a... I thought they might do like a Hellrider or a Thunder Mahalkite. Those, those would be a problem. But I think right now we will be able to steal anything big that they play. If not, we'll just probably pass with Venser. That's eh, kind of annoying. No, I did not see. I, I heard about it, actually, but I did not see it. What are we getting with Imperial Recruiter? Seth accidentally chose to sack two lands from a Lily, and he won because of it? Are you serious? That's kind of amazing. So let's um, Metamorph Gang, probably, and... Do we get to do anything else? We don't really get to do anything else. Um, and then we can kill their Siege Gang Commander by sacrificing a thing. Yeah, 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 this looks good. So let's go one, two, three. We gotta do this before they untap. Four. Ugh. All right. Copy Siege Gang, we get some goblins, and then we'll throw a goblin. How's this templated? Sacrifice a goblin, Siege Gang, Commander, deals two damage to target creature player. Okay. Uh, sacrifice, choose target creature player, you. Pay two. Uh, let's throw a goblin. And now they don't have goblins to throw because they're not untapped. Okay, I feel like we are firmly in control of this game. It would take something kind of weird out of Mono Red for... For us to I lose a grip on this, I think. Oh, yeah, that's kind of annoying. It's not the end of the world, though. Uh, this is not Storm Narbly. This is Twinless Twin. This is like the typical twin deck when you drafted everything for the twin deck, but you didn't see Deceiver Exarch or Pestermite. Will you sign my petition to remove Top from Legacy now that it's banned in Legacy? Yes! In fact, I will help promote that petition. I hate it. It's so bad. I hate it so much. Uh, what are we getting with Imperial Recruiter? Yeah, top is still in the cube, and I hate it so much. We could just um, Imperial Recruiter for Jace Prince Prodigy. 
Yeah, JM, I'm thinking of that. I'm also thinking of Imperial Recruiter to block the Jackal Pup, and then we'll get, like, Jacevin's Prodigy to block one of these goblins. I would like to ban top from everything. And then Jace gets to live, and then we find another land so we can Ral bolt down one of these other things. It might be that Venser is just better. Oh yeah, Snap to Fire Ice again does sound pretty appealing. That's gonna have to be a different turn though. So I think we're just on the Venser plan this turn. Dude, I, I would be very happy with that petition. I hate top and also it just shouldn't be in the cube. It's legacy cube, how's top in here? That just feels like oversight. I think I'm gonna bounce the Jackal Pug. Although, bouncing a goblin just straights up kill it and then we block another one and then we take four. Yeah, this actually sounds fine. Let's block one of the goblins and then eat one of these goblins. And we take four, which is kind of annoying, but whatever. Legacy cube only means that it's not powered cube. But it's, no, but because they do the same with Modern Cube, and in Modern Cube, they also took out all the mo not modern legal cards. So I don't know that I, I don't know that I buy that. Uh, I think if we play Ral, tap the Bolt, and then we have an Is It Charm, right? Yeah, that sounds good. All right, let's do it. One, two, three, four. Kill that. Take three damage. Now they don't have attacks anymore, and we have an Izzet Charm on our side. Oh, yeah, they can add Jason Mind Sculpture to the Modern Cube. You're right. I always like this goblin token. It's really cute. Yeah, you didn't have attacks. I didn't think so. For reals? They're both coming at me. Is this just like a... I feel like if they're attacking me, that scares me. I'm gonna... Oh, he's a charm, the other one. They might have enough burn in their hand that they want to just burn me out. Because sending in both goblins to get in one point of damage through seems asinine. Strong Kirk nobles. Incendiary flow, okay. Yeah, dude, it just feels like... It feels like they're up to some nonsense if, if what they're trying to get is just like sneak one point of damage through like it's... Um, I'm gonna set up for the Imperial Recruiter, uh, getting back snappy for something. So, we are gonna control magic this probably. Let's go... Mind Stone. I'm gonna Mind Stone into control magic this thing. Yeah, we can't currently deal with it, and I don't want Ral to die. So... Hello, Kiank, how are you? Hold on, I'm gonna not do, not activate Rally yet. You guys, Kiank did all the art for um, my stream panels. Uh, she did an amazing job, I think it looks awesome. I'm gonna tap this and untap Fencer. I don't wanna untap Stone for draw because I actually want the land, because next turn I'm going to Imperial Recruiter for Mindstone and then cast the spell off a of Snapcaster. Yeah, you, everything looks amazing, Kiank. I'm also going to have Kiank, I'm going to commission her for a t-shirt for us. We still have to kind of figure out what we want to do for that, but I did talk to her about it. This is, you. yeah, it's always Phantom. Uh, all the cubes are always usually Phantom. Uh, yeah. 
four to me, three to my, three to our face. That's a problem. This is why they were suiciding their goblins, yeah. Makes sense. Can we gain, do we have any way to gain life in this? Oh, Glenn is perfect. You're right. And pure recruiter for Glenn is all you want to do. Uh, Glenelandra. One, two, three, four. Hey, Benny, how are you? It is good to see you. And we're gonna... Yeah, look at how not sucking Mindstone is actually playing out. I just thought I really was gonna need the mana, Molly. And that's basically it. Getting some counters. Okay, I'm gonna tap. I think I'd rather have tap this and on top island. I'd rather have double blue up. Than like untapping Stormcrook Noble. I don't think that's actually gonna matter. Okay. So now they need something like Thunder Mahalkite. Oh, my face is pretty off screen. Yeah, I need a. I'll fix that eventually. It's just kind of how I have the the face cam set up right now. But this is where the center of it would be. Muta Vault. Well, this is bad news. Are they gonna kill me with a trigger on the stack? No, they didn't. Alrighty, Shell Duck Isle. Interesting. Uh, yeah, I think we Shell Duck first. Actually, let's crack Mindstone first. Dissolve is good. Shell Duck. We can untap Shelly too. Oh, Snapcaster Mage is sweet. I think that's better than Stroke of Genius or almost anything else because we can Snapcaster for like Vince. Oh, sorry, we can Snapcaster for like Fire Eyes, Factor Fiction. Yeah, Shelldock Growl is totally a combo. Forbid. I don't think it's forbid. I, I legit think it's snappy. Forbid for sure. Yeah, I don't I'm not taking stroke of genius here. I think it's snappy or or forbid. Hey rabbits, how are you? Like we don't even have to cards for forbid right now. And we even have the dissolve in hand. I'm taking snappy. I think it'd be different if we didn't have Snappy. Uh, long days, long days. Well, I hope you're doing well, Rabbits. Uh, tap Mutable, untap Shelly. Yeah, so we're twin less twin, Rabbits, but I do like our deck a lot. I think it's very good. Uh, we have Snap under there, so we can send it with Glenn and Stromkirk. Actually, we can send with all of them, I think. <laughs> I do, I like Toneless Twin Rabbits. I, I have always been into it. Uh, does it change the clock? We're gonna hit for four. I think I'm just sending with everybody, yeah. Okay, we have some good... Um, yeah, I know that this Mutable is just not gonna block Stromkirk. It's also like, at this point, wouldn't even have a good block on it anyway. Are you going into Lurk? 
Sounds good. King, thank you so much for stopping in. It was so good to see you. You actually prefer no Windex. <laughs> hey, Neo Bubbles. Welcome. It's a bold move attacking into untapped shell duck isle, but my opponent chose to do it anyway. Yeah. All right, so we're playing against mono reds. Uh, it looks like Agra Bulls is actually MVP in this mana wars. Not too shabby. Bounce some of their stuff and block their tokens. They seem to have a lot of one ones. Uh, burst lightning, a braid. Power of Devastation is not insane. Board out Karanos. Oh yeah, look at this. Look at this. Isn't this sweet? Jason Mind Sculptor. Better than all. No, that that is true, Time Twister. It is just funny when like I mean when you're mono red and you're like, I'm certainly dead here, but I mean might as well attack, you know. <laughs> yeah, old man. Oh yeah, I did not bring my old man. I should bring my old man. I think probably Titty is good too. Uh, don't think into the royal. Like, bouncing one token doesn't seem like what I want to be doing. Warhammer can be good. Yeah, I agree. Uh, Metamorph is here. I don't think the fairy is really where we want to be at. This is 44 cards. Yeah, stroke is a little slow. We're not stroking ourselves this game. Mm. <laughs> Why do cards, magic cards sound so filthy? It's not my fault when they set me up like that. Mm. Locks it on Warhammer. Uh, yeah, for a bit is actually kind of slow here. It doesn't get old. That old th that joke is never. Oh, control magic looks pretty terrible. Yeah, deep analysis. <laughs> we need to make two more cuts. Uh, Mindstone. Yeah, it could be Mindstone. Can we play Mistress Factory? We could. I don't think I want Elder Deep Fiend. Metamorph is not copying great things. That's a good point. I mean, we do have good stuff that we have, but our creatures are pretty small. We could cut the Mindstone because we make our deck, um, we made it a lot cheaper. Yeah, actually, Dissolve, you're right. Dissolve, does, we're not really countering anything great. Raoul, I think, is fine, Mithu. Uh, yeah, this looks good. I like the Mindstone. No, I think the mind, keeping the Mindstone is fine. Early mana ramp and late game card draw is pretty nice. Ooh, these are nice. Um, we do need red. We have one. I guess we're not shuffling. I guess these are all so nice. We can go our devastation, Vencer fact factor fiction. Yeah, I want to draw factor fiction first. So our devastation, Vencer factor fiction. Uh, do not shuffle. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to draw them all before it matters, Molly, but I still think it's just probably a good, good habit to figure out which order you want to draw your cards in or whatever. Um, I don't think there's many cards that are going to pump its toughness, so I'm going to see if I can, like, debate them into 
trying to pump the kiln fiend a bunch of times and then just deal it to damage. Hi, Irish. How are you? All right, let's see what they got. Show me what you got. Nada. Dead. We actually had a lot of really good cards to board in against Mono Red. That's pretty dope. They might be killing this, but... If it's killing the old man of the sea, it's not killing me. Can control target creature with power. Yeah, that's that's totally fine. This is not MTG Arena. This is Magic Online. MTG Arena, I think, is going to be streamable. They've said it seems like they might be streamable around March-ish, so I will be streaming it then. Good night, Addis. I'll check out how this ends on YouTube later. Sounds good, Addis. I think our devastation could do 10 damage this game somehow. Oh, hello. Uh, no, I don't part They didn't surge it, though. I guess... Oh, I know. I know what we're doing. We're going to let that resolve. Uh, this is round two. Irish, we're up a match. Yeah, we're going to let that attack, and then we're going to Venser and bounce the jackal pup but trade with a reckler bushwhacker because i don't want to i don't want to bounce this otherwise they might be able to surge it do you think they'll eventually offer a way to transfer empty geo assets to arena i would doubt it i would i i would doubt that um okay we'll just factor fiction on their turn You would have fought and taken four there. I just don't want to... Um, I just don't really want to take any damage against them, Ravis. They seem to have... They do have a lot of burn. Uh, that's fine. I might hour devastation that. We'll see. Hello. That's a hand. <laughs> Yeah, I don't think I, I don't think MTG Arena and MTG are gonna interact in cards in any way. Obviously, I don't I don't have any information. Like I don't know, but I don't think it will. Yeah, I like they have a lot of burn and they even have Crater's Claws and stuff. So I don't really want to take any damage. Split is reasonable from our opponent. You're here for cube? You came to the right place. I think I'm taking Augur Glen. Do you think they'll put redeemable codes in physical booster packs for Arena? I doubt it, Nido King. Yeah. I think I'm taking Glenn and Augur. Like, yeah, Jason Mind Sculpture's amazing, obviously, but... Ooh, Imperial Recruiter's nice. Uh, I, I'm just gonna, uh, our Devastation right now, I don't particularly... care to kill a Jackal Pup to deal extra damage, it just doesn't matter. And this is a clean way to deal with a Thunderbreak. You can't let Jace go. I think I think I think Jace will forgive us. He will be fine. Glenn is also really good against our opponent, so would have taken the other pile for sure. I guess you and I play very different rabbits. 
Uh, sure. Rail's not bad. Thunder Mohalakai, thank you so much for that host. Thank you, thank you, and welcome if you're coming in from Thunder Mohalakai's stream. Welcome, my name is Gabby, and we are playing Legacy Cube today. I just came out on Magic Online today. Legacy Cube is super fun, so we are going to have some good times with it. <laughs> we wrecked them, actually, while played. Glenlandra is one of the best preachers ever. Princess. It is. It is. I love me, Glenlandra. I think I'm going to play Ral and then Augur, and I'm going to bolt one of their creatures. One, two, three, four. Juicy James with a two month resub. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Classic case of. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I, I sent like the really aggressive lol <laughs> to my opponent. Used to play force. Oh, I'm getting bolted. All right. Shoal. Sure. Yeah, I'm feeling... Oh, classic Trader of Bolas. <laughs> Look at the bottom three cards of your library and pass. <laughs> uh, we get to shuffle in a second. We even shuffled bad stuff to the bottom. We might get that thing in the ice, maybe. This has always been and will continue to be a Trader of Bolas stream. So they bolted my Ral. Sure, that's reasonable. Reasonable. Gooby guide. Can I draw a card? Drawing Snapcaster's not too shay, Abby. Uh, what is the best we can get out of this Snapperinos? Oh, Factor Fiction? Yeah, that's dope. Oh yeah, not bolting the, the two, 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 cost two life there. Yeah, I'm gonna snap Factor Fiction. Sounds awesome. Snap off that kid, please explain why in great detail. All right. Ooh, I even drew a card. Nice. I didn't think I was gonna get to cast two factor fictions this game. This is amazing! Thank you so much, Solus. Thank you so much, and welcome back with the four months. Opponent scoop waiting room. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh. <laughs> uh. I think I'm taking Shelly Pile. Like, very clearly there. I don't know. 
That was kind of like a draw five. Uh, Augur here, and Vandal gets to die. You're whistling to summon my dogs. <laughs> oh boy, rekindling Phoenix? That card's kind of annoying. Uh, let's Shelly. Mana War's nice. Mana War's what we want down here, too. Uh, do we have Phyrexian Metamorph in the deck? We do. Phoenix is in the cube, lady. Hello, welcome the Hickinator. So we can this turn Imperial Recruiter get Metamorph. Can conscript my shell dock if I want to use it now. I think I want to buy. Sorry, not buy. I think I want to get. Um, like I'm gonna set it up so that I bounce. I mana war their token. So I'm gonna recruiter for uh, Phyrexian Metamorph to copy the Rekindling Phoenix. Wait, what? Am I crazy? Oh, we boarded out Metamorph. F. Okay. Need a new plan. Thing in the ice it is. We boarded out Metamorph. Mm. Yeah, we boarded it out. Okay. New plan. New plan. Metamorph was into Glimpse the Unthinkable. Yep, we're current plan is get j this Jace online and we'll our devastation. Or whatever, we just need to deal it. Oh, I guess our devastation is our only way to deal with it, huh? Okay. We, we have figured out the answer. We still need to deal with a smuggler's copter, though. We can't attack and win, don't, do we? We don't have... Burst Lightning kills the Copter, yes. Hmm. Attack and win is the new bounce and win. It's usually just bounce and win. I'm not even sure what we're supposed to do this. Okay. Uh, I think we're attacking with everyone. We're, a well, we don't actually even have attacks, huh? This is game two, I think. Like, I want them to crew the smuggler's copter. What happens if Rekindling Phoenix dies while it's in my control? Do I get it back? Because I kind of want to steal the Rekindling Phoenix, I think. Yeah, my attacks are terrible. But if I take the Rekindling Phoenix and attack with Zealous Con Conscript and Phoenix, then I can burst lightning the Phoenix and then Mana War to bounce it. You get the egg, but you don't get the Phoenix in the yard. Oh. So they would not... Yeah, as long as they don't get it back, that's fine. Okay, we're going to take... Uh, one, two, three, four, five. It doesn't matter as long as they don't get it back. That's the only thing I care about. Hey, Swankmo, how are you? We're probably timing out of this draft.
Oh, our plan was that I thought they were gonna... I thought they were gonna block, but I guess they didn't. That actually messes up my plan. We can burst lightning, kill Phoenix. Oh shit, it's not four. Fuck. I messed that up. All right, we're killing, we're killing the goblin guide. Yeah, that was a, I thought it was four, not four and one. Like, four's the kicker. We will be fine. We're just gonna set up, we're just, we'll just mana war this thing in a second. Like, the copter or the phoenix, it doesn't really matter. We can take a hit from it, bounce it at the end of the turn, and just attack with everybody. Oh, hello. That's not a creature yet, though. Yeah, we're fine. Don't worry, chat. We're doing fine. Boop. Yeah, we're fine. We're we're just gonna win. I'd be surprised if we lost this game somehow. Uh, come into play. Bounce the phoenix. I might actually loot my Glenelundra away. Depending on what I draw. Oh, I can just pitch Mountain. Alright. Uh, we have... One, two, three, four... Yeah, don't I just burst bath flashback burst lightning? And pay the actual cost to flashback burst lightning as opposed to four, which is what I wanted to do. <laughs> Well, bam. All right. That is two games we've been dangerously close to timing out. We would not have game. Actually, we won a game with like in two minutes or something. So we technically did have enough time for game three. <laughs> that game was pretty silly. I believe you can kick her from the graveyard. You just get to cast it again. Time out Tuesday on a Wednesday. Stunlock, we're changing variety day to be Tuesdays. So now maybe the new variety is to, to, to time out on Tuesdays. <laughs> or to not time out on Tuesday, rather. Everything coming up goobies. Yeah, we're, we're doing good. We're doing good. We, I like our deck. I think it's good. Yeah, we can keep this. New varieties to get carried in Fortnite. I need a lot of carrying stunlock. That's for freaking sure. You probably Vencer underneath Shell Dock is pretty nice. Um, Forbid underneath Shell Dock is kind of nice. Or Ral. I think I'm gonna put, I love Venser. I think Venser's awesome. I think I'm gonna put Venser underneath a shell dock. Venser's just one of my favorite cards. Clock winding down Wednesdays, lols. I <laughs> uh, cannot play Sulphur Falls, that's just a land. Tis but a land. I'll probably into the royal this thing. Have no e into this and then having that in play. 
Jason Mine Sculptor better than all. That is the wrong colored land. Uh, let's get Glen, I guess. Oh, you we, we could have charmed it. You're right. Yeah, I should have just charmed it. Because then we can cast into the world later in the game. I'm going to get Glen, I think. Or I can... In a following turn, I can play Jace Rinse Prodigy. And... have Is it charm in the same turn? Maybe I'll just get Jace. Our opponent's missing land drops. Monochromatic. Monochromatic welcome. Uh, we could just Jace bounce their Jace Finn's Prodigy. The only problem is I think if they're a burn deck, maybe they just burn my Jace. But then that's not even that big of a deal, right? No, you know what? I'm going to charm this and play JVP yeah I like Jason charming it there they're also missing lane so like clearly they drew this off the top hmm this is actually working out great take a look at this now we just keep lands we make sure that they don't draw lands because they're clearly missing land drops so we start fate sealing them uh put it on the bottom no they get to draw that that was chandra big chandra Oh yeah, we'd def rather lose small J's. That worked out fine. See, and now they can't do anything, so we're just gonna keep fate sealing and making sure they don't draw lands. And now we can play Glen. Oh! I like that even better. Let's keep fate sealing. Put it on the bottom? Yes. Uh... Fate seal is pretty brutal. I think I'm gonna, I kind of want to, does this make you feel like a bully? <laughs> I kind of want to Glen. Glen just stops them from doing anything. Like fact or fiction, I almost was tempted to main phase it so that we can make a land drop, which means that I probably, oh, is Glen not legendary? Wow, we could actually copy Glen with Phyrexian Metamorph. Gap, if your opponent didn't call no bully, it's technically okay. Uh, yeah, I'll let that happen. Go on the Lundra is a place. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a sim. Isn't it like a Tilesnia place? Funnily enough, into the role, and Jace ended up being really good. Yeah, <laughs> it somehow worked out very well. <laughs> they say you and Molly. I shouldn't have done it. She protects, she attacks. I think I'm going to sack this. Our opponent's so mana screwed, I don't know. You say let her resolve and slam another Glen. I was like super into continuing, continuing to have them be mana screwed. This egg, this uh, ult at 12. We're gonna win with Jace ult. This is some super aggro no lands for you nonsense. <laughs> I don't know. I, 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 I am kind of enjoying it. Uh, I think I want a factor fiction main phase. A 
Lols. I'm just taking three. Three of a kind. Pow. I am the worst fall forever. That's the second time I fought for five lands. Ah, oh, they missed the land again. We are doing it. They can keep Flame Tongue Kabu. Put it on the bottom? No. Uh, I have Vancer also. Sensor is rude considering what's going on. I think I'm just going to sell us conscripts. Sensor combos well with the no lands. I'm just going to sell us conscripts and start attacking them. And I mean, we're going to win with Jace. Steal their sacred foundry, I guess. I don't know. Wow, so rude. What is this? No way. Could have answered that too, but I'd rather just like actually lose that. All right. We're playing so Gabby bully. Yes. So we don't have something that interacts with Deceiver Exarch. They seem to be a twin deck. That was a serious Gabby bully game. Do we even have cards that we want to sideboard? Si sorry, sideboard. I guess Burst Lightning is kind of an answer to Deceiver Exarch. You need five mana for it though. Pio Gray, thank you so much for the three months and welcome back. How are you doing? Thank you Gabby for supporting wow, the Gabby stream. Wow, kitty, Gabby, wow, Gabby, wow. <laughs> thank you, I appreciate that. I wonder if opponent had Exard and Twin in handle game. They might have. We did. We certainly didn't see it, but they might have. Sidebird for life. Oh, is that a uh, wait? Sidebird? What are you talking about? <laughs> Braid is a sideburn card. I think there's only leagues, rabbits. I believe only only leagues. I thought we were actually playing Constructed Legacy and was very confused when I saw Singleton draft. <laughs> yeah, no, I like our deck. I like where we ended up. Why don't you like leagues, rabbits? I really like leagues. I thought there were cues for cube. Are you sure? I thought it was only leagues. A braid doesn't kill Exarch, but hits Conscript, Kiki, and other blue. Maybe we do a braid and burst lightning, and we take out, like... <sighs> How good is Raul going to be here, really? I don't think very good. <sighs> Fire Ice, maybe? Confirm there are single limb cues, don't light a chat. I, I didn't think they had those. All right, I'm taking fire eyes. I don't know, it doesn't seem like it's gonna do that much. Something that like, Less than four heart is pretty awkward. <laughs> uh. I, I brought 
and the abraid. There, it does answer some things. I'm gonna keep this. Yeah, less than four. What was the abraid for? I think they're a twin deck, and so they might have some things that I want to kill at instant speed. Yeah, our opponent's a good sport. Less than four. Uh, yeah, like that's something we want to kill, for example. I heard Chevy Kawai, thank you so much for the three months. Welcome back. This is one of my friends from Chicago, you guys. Thank you so much, Mark. I really appreciate that. How are you doing? How's the stream going? You guys, also, Mark is on my stream team, by the way. You should check out his stream. His stream is fun. He plays Eternal. You guys have seen me play Eternal every once in a while. We can't kill Young PZ yet. We can censor something next turn, but they're still gonna start getting value. Hmm, I think I'm in a cycle. All right, perfect. I think we actually do that. I mean, I don't want them to tap out of mana, so I guess I'm just gonna go to their turn. And if they tap out on my turn, then I'll abrade. Good, I'll be in just a big just go ahead. From climbing, I'm about to eat. You like climbing? That's so sweet. You're playing seep? Deep Rock tonight. Oh, I have heard some people say... I'm gonna do it on their end step, I think. Yeah. Good night, Sliver. Land. For control magic. Urgh. Oh, I'm sorry, oh my god. It's unfortunate. Hey, Henry. Get hype. I was missing a land drop there was bad. <laughs> yeah, Recruiter does block. I guess we're playing Recruiter. Recruiter for like JBP, I think. Could be recruiter for Snappy to try to braid. Uh, maybe it's just Jace. Hello. Hola, mami. Estoy transmitiendo. Podemos hablar más tarde. Yeah. Besos. Chao. Gracias. Chao, chao. I don't think we're winning this one. They have Glenn and Activation up. I guess we're just casting like Venser on their turn. Opponent has all your cards except they're better. Well, our opponent has all of our cards except they have mana, is mostly what this game has been about. I'm gonna try to bounce Glenn and block the elemental. I can't stand playing against the cards in my deck in cube. Lol, at board is a personal matter. Sure. <laughs> they have our twinless deck, but with twin, yes. All right, them casting, recasting. Maybe I wanted to take damage from it anyway, but I have creatures to play, so I'm not, I just really need to draw land, my goodness. See, 
Nia Kiang, thank you so much for hanging in with us today and stopping by. I appreciate that. We're gonna copy Glenn. Look, we're doing the best out of a bad situation. That is surprising. For reals? I feel like I'd rather have Glenn just counter something so often. So... Uh... So this is this is interesting. If I sack Glenn, they they still get the token. They don't get to scry. Yeah. That is cute what they did. They made it so that we don't um we can't recopy Glenn Alendra. I think I'm going to fizzle. And now I have to recopy, and I think I'm going to copy Pyromancer. Although most of our cards are non-creatures. Actually, is Pyromancer even that good? Maybe it's Recruiter. Thank you for the shot. Oh, yeah. You don't get another Recruiter, though, since you drew Jace. Oh, yeah, we don't have Thing in the Ice. I guess... Yeah, you're right. It doesn't matter. Oh. It comes back with a minus one, minus one counter. So we, it doesn't matter what we copy there, I guess. That's unfortunate. Neither one does anything. Yeah, of course, Mark. Uh, I think I'll let that through. We don't have any more creatures to, re to recruit her for. Oh, is the snap left? I thought we were out. That's why I stopped considering recruiter. My gosh, why? Uh, I thought I was out of creatures. That's why I stopped considering recruiter at some point. Uh... Yeah, so getting Snapcaster here would have been amazing before because we snap and then we just kill Kiki Jiki. Now we don't even have that as an option. I guess we're on Glenelendra and possible Counterspell and probably just die. Oh, that's right, they have the Glennon play. Yeah, so I guess we are not killing Kiki Jiki here almost no matter what. <sighs> I'll probably play Karanos next turn. I think I'd rather have Glennelendra here for like... They're gonna, they're just gonna untap and have one of the creatures is our problem. Control magic, that's a bad, that's a bad idea. All right. I'm not going to make my opponent go through it. Uh, so I think we do want the abrade. There's a couple of things that we want to kill. Hey, Jamie, it's been so long. How have you been? I mean, I guess it hasn't been that long. I hadn't seen you in a while, and I stopped by your stream, and I got to say hi. 
But then before that, it had been a while. How's it going? Hey, Gabby, you've been lurking for the last hour or so because of how you're doing. And Maxwell, good. We are in the finals of this cube draft. Um, our opponent has a very good deck. Our opponent has, like, our deck, except it's better. <laughs> Fire Ice might be necessary here also. Hey, Black, welcome. I don't think I want old man. Yeah, so we have twinless twin. Okay, we're gonna take Karanos out. I don't think we want Karanos. Our opponent has twinless twin, and or we have twinless twin, and our opponent has twin. <laughs> is basically what the matchup is right now. Uh, I guess I can keep this. It's not very good. We would like to have more planeswalkers or something. Let's kick it off with Fumarol. Glenn's a very good draw. Okay. Oh, that's true. Old man is good versus Glenn. Hmm. Maybe that is a reason to board an old man. I'm not gonna use this to charm, I don't think. Uh, we did bring Fire Ice, but it wasn't over control magic. Our opponent's on do nothings. I think I'm not playing Glenn here. Oh, I didn't. I I didn't play thing in the eyes. So. Someone's going to be forced to take some action here when we run out of cards. Um, playing Imperial Recruiter and passing with a Counterspell sounds pretty appealing, so we can start maybe doing the thing here. You have three hits left in there still. JVP, Metamorph, and Snappy. Maybe Snappy is going to be good in the long game. Metamorph is good, but I don't even know what we'd be metamorphing. Get zealous and steal their kiki. <laughs> that would be kind of sweet. I think I'm taking um, Snapcaster. I think it's going to be best in like a longer game. Jace Friend's Prodigy. Actually, the reason to take Jace Friend's Prodigy is if we just keep doing this like back and forth of doing nothing, having a Jace in play is actually pretty nice. So yeah, chat has convinced me. I want Jace Friend's Prodigy. Old oh, man, if untapped can take Kiki Jiki or uh, that's fine. Hello, get snap. Hey Lakers, I ended up getting Jace Friend's Prodigy. I think it's close. Oh, that is acceptable. Legacy Cube is back, indeed. That was a kind of aggro jet, I agree. Okay. The main reason I don't like this- Hey, I'm Mar Brownlee! Welcome to the stream! The main reason I don't like this is I don't want them to draw a card. So I'm gonna charm this. Because we also still get to have Dissolve. Like, I would feel a little reticent if we didn't also get to have Dissolve. But now we get a Jace Fringe Prodigy in play. They don't get to draw a card and we still have Counterspell up. And next turn we can play Glenn with Counterspell also. You're out for the rest of the stream. Sounds good, Mark. Enjoy the rest of your night, and thank you so much for joining us for a little bit. I'm gonna... JVP. 
SAT word warning. Oh, reticent? <laughs> Koma Green, thank you so much for the first time sub and welcome to the brood. Thank you so much for supporting us. I appreciate it. Um, we are a control deck and we do have Stroke of Genius in our deck. I don't know how much we want Burst Lightning. We could just... I liked it. Reticent is a good word. I like it. Think... I wouldn't even fall off on the same turn that I Glenn because it tabs me out in Methu. So, so I don't think I want that. I think I'm actually pitching. Yeah, I think I'm pitching the Burst Lightning. Burst Lightning just doesn't do a whole lot. And now I'm going to go one, two, three, four. We have counter spells and stuff, so I'm not worried about dying to twin out of the blue. Fudge. Yeah, Methu is a person. God, I really don't have like I don't like Deceiver in play. I don't want them to have Deceiver at all. I'm just gonna counter it and not have to deal with it, and I don't really care for this mountain, so I'm gonna bottom it. Cause we still get to have Glendalendra here. Yeah, I just, I don't know, having a Deceiver Exorc in place, I think the way we lose the grip on this game, because we have a really nice hold on it, right? We have JVP that's about to transform. We have Glen, Alendra in play and active. We have a Fact of Fiction in hand. That's fine. I identify as a person. Uh, let's JVP. Uh, this is five cards, correct? Five or more cards. So this is going to be the fifth one. I think I like Miscalc, so I'm going to pitch Spire Bluff. And uh, let's flash back Is It Charm to kill the JVP, I think. Yeah, I, I, I'm not in the business of letting them have JVP in play. Not at all. And then we'll be able to factor fiction at the end of their turn. I feel like we have a good grip on this game. I think we're... It's all coming together. Uh, because PO Grey, uh, the flashback... The other modes on... on Like, the flashback burst lightning gets to be kicked. So at some point, I might want to go face. And the other one only is cast at basically sorcery speed anyway. Uh... I think Compulsive's fine. They have six cards in hand. Yeah, exactly, Mem Knight. I think letting them draw with Compulsive is fine. Hello. I'm taking the pile of Snapcaster. Yeah. Because we can just flashback Factor Fiction. Just go off. <laughs> Ooh, Fire Ice is nice. Okay. <laughs> Finally not five lands, right? We're doing it. Finally doing it. <laughs> Your opponent should file a bug report that was supposed to be five lands. Cube! Yes, Vokeos, it is time. Prepare yourself for Cube! I do not want them to evoke this. Nuh-uh. Well, they get to... Oh, we Venser and then we miscalc. Yeah, one, two, three, four.
Well, Molly, I also don't mind getting a uh, getting a uh, two two in play so that I can start attacking them too. Now that they're at seven and they did all this and they've played it again, now I think I'll actually let it resolve. Um, and they'll have to discard. Because now they're at nine and they might play a land, and if not, they're going to have to discard two anyway. Well, they're going to have to discard one. Seems like Miscloak is unlikely to... What are our other options? Uh, Snappy and two. Nah, there's like nothing good. I'll just cycle. How much longer until my move? It's like so soon, Henry. Tomorrow is my last day, uh, my last stream from this apartment. Okay, cool. We got this. No, I don't want to swing with Fumarole. We have this game on lockdown, Rucifer. We don't need to be tapping out a ton. Uh, I'm moving to Denver, Hawkeyes. That I'm super not okay with. Uh, probably Snap Dissolve. And then we can Forbid. I'm moving to an apartment in Denver at Artillery, so not with him, but I'm going to be very close to him. Bottom. Ah, we'll survive, Mithu. <laughs> Flame Tongue Kavu. <laughs> we might see each other from time to time. What happens if I actually let this resolve? I can steal the it can sell us conscripts and I take four, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna let it resolve. I just have the win if if I let it I have the win if I let it resolve too, Molly. Because next turn I go conscripts 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and I can just fire at their face for good. Well, I don't even need to. Kapow! No, oh, we don't get to see what our opponent said because because magic online. But ba 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 We did it, chat. We trophied despite almost timing out twice. <laughs> oh god, the first game was really really something else. No, nah, rabbits, I'm I'm calling it. I've actually been streaming for like 6 damn. I've been streaming for 6 hours. Today was a long stream. Uh all right, you guys, this is the deal. Tomorrow I am packing. I'm doing my last packing because I'm moving super soon. So tomorrow we'll have a stream, but it'll be early in the morning, and I only really have time to do one draft, and then we're going to call it. It's going to be the last stream from this apartment. So we're going to wait. We will, we will cherish it for what it is. Six hours is a baby stream? No way. Six hours is a long stream. Um... Thank you so much for joining me today. If you enjoyed the stream, please make sure you follow the stream so you get notified when I go live. I stream every weekday in the afternoons Central Times. Also, let me do the sign up for YouTube. If you're watching this on YouTube, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe for more. 
You can see more of these on youtube.com slash gabbysparts. And if you want to see, say hi to us in the live stream, you can come to twitch.tv slash gabbysparts. I stream every weekday in the afternoons, central times. Thanks for watching, YouTube.